Hello and welcome to our Home Pulse Oximetry Instruction video. You should have a box containing all the equipment you will need to carry out a home sleep study. This box will include one of these monitors, a sensor, a cable and a power cable. The oximeter records the oxygen in your child's blood and their heart rate. Step 1. Attaching the sensor. Open the pouch and remove the sensor. Locate the sensor and identify the black square and the star symbol. Remove the clear plastic backing from the sensor and the sticky bandage wrap. Sensor placement for a younger child. The sticky side of the sensor attaches to the foot. Place the sensor so that the tail runs away from your child. Apply the black square onto the fleshy part of the sole of the foot. Wrap the sensor around the foot and ensure that the star symbol aligns directly opposite the black square. It is helpful to place a sock over your child's foot and ensure the probe stays attached. Step 2. Attach the sensor to the cable. Position the sensor connector tab so that the shiny gold contacts are facing up. Position the patient cable with the black line facing up. Insert the sensor tab into the patient cable until there is a click of connection. Look at the end and push the cable into the red port on the oximeter. Step 3. Turning on the oximeter. Put the black power lead into the power supply at the back of the monitor. Connect the monitor to the mains electricity supply. You may use an extension lead if necessary. Turn on the oximeter by pressing the power button. This will go through a system test and then start to search for a signal. The numerical data is displayed in these boxes. The top number in red is oxygen saturations. The bottom number in green is heart rate. These will be displayed during your child's study. Alarm limits for your child will be preset before you receive the pulse oximeter. You will receive an instruction sheet with actions to take should the alarm sound overnight. If the oxygen saturations or heart rate breach the preset alarm limits, the numbers will flash on the screen so you are aware which parameter has been breached. If this occurs, please refer to the instruction sheet. Lay the monitor flat on the floor at the end of your child's bed and leave it to collect data. Step 4. Disconnecting the monitor. To turn the monitor off, press and hold the power button. All the lights will go off and this will save the data. Disconnect the sticky disposable sensor from the cable and throw the sensor away. Please wipe down the cable, the black power lead and the oximeter with the alcohol wipe provided before putting them back in the box to be returned. If recording more than one night's study, please ensure that the monitor is turned off and on in between nights. Thank you for watching our home sleep study setup guide and we hope you have a successful sleep study.